Richard. Good morning, Ivy. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> How are you today, Richard? I am. Uh, uh, I am tired. You are tired. <laughs> Why? Why are you tired today? I get up. Uh, I get up late. You get up early. Did you yes. get up? All right. What did you do a while ago? Or what did you do before our class? Mm -hmm. What did you do before our class? Uh, uh huh. What uh, did you do today? Um, Oh, oh, I don't know. <laughs> All right, wait a minute. Okay, I will translate that, okay? Did you eat your Hi. breakfast, Richard? Did you eat breakfast? Yes. Oh. I uh, eat breakfast. You eat I... breakfast? Yes. Uh, what did you eat for breakfast? Uh, what did you eat? I eat I eat rice, meat, and uh, an egg in <laughs> breakfast. Wow! You ate? Can you say I ate? Yes. Yes. I ate. All right. Yeah, I ate rice meat and egg very good <laughs> okay so are you ready to start our class richard do you want to learn more okay but before uh -huh, before we start our class richard <laughs> before we start our class Let's introduce ourselves, or I will oh. tell you again my name, and you will tell me your name too, okay? Okay. All right. So, my name is Teacher Michelle, and I will be your English teacher for today, okay? Oh. And during my free time, during my free time, I love reading books. And I also love singing. Yes. <laughs> How about you? What's your name again? My name is Richard. I I, I am student uh, in a primary uh, primary Kim Zhang. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, I am ten years old. My hobbies. My hobbies is play game, search internet, and uh, uh, and uh, go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> All right. My hobbies is. Can you repeat that? Can you say it again? What are your hobbies? My hobby is playing the game, search the internet, and go to the bed. Okay, all right. And go to the bed. bed. All right. Can you say, my hobbies are? Do my not say is, okay? You should say, my hobbies are. My hobby is are. Oh, you should not say is. Don't say the word is. You should say, okay. my hobbies are. Ah. Right. Can you say, my hobbies are play games, search the internet, and go to bed? My hobby is are, are. play the game, search the internet, and go to the bed. Okay, this one. My hobbies are play games, playing games, or playing games, 
searching. Searching to the internet and go to bed. All right, wait a minute. All right, can you read that, Richard? Okay. I can see the mail. Message. I yes. can see the your message. Oh, you should read the message in your chat box. Can you read okay. that? Okay. Wait. Mm -hmm. You cannot see it. Okay. All right. Oh, this one, Richard, you can read here. Yes, my hobby is our play right. the game. Can you see my screen, Richard? Can you see my screen? Yes. All right. Can you read this word here? This one. Okay. My hobby is I, my hobby is I play games such to in the t internet and go to bed. All right, that's how are you going to say it? Do not say my hobbies is okay. You should say my hobbies are okay. Okay. All right, very good, mm -hmm. Richard. <laughs> All right. Okay. So how old how old are you again? My, how, how old are you? I am 10 years old. All right, very good. You are 10 years old. Good job. Yeah. All right. So now, Richard, can you see my screen, right? You can yes. see my screen? Okay, very good. So our topic for today is Unit 1 Manners. Can you say it? Yes, unit one manners. All right, can you say this one again? Manners. manners. All right, so have you heard this word before? Do you know this word, manners? Do you know the word manners? Manners. Okay. So now we will find out the meaning of manners later, okay? All right, before that, let's move on to the pronunciation, okay? Here. Okay. <clears throat> you are going to try to pronounce the words below. So we are going to read, okay? We will read these words. So here, Richard, this is, all right, wait a minute. Okay. Wait a minute, Richard. Okay, we will read these words, okay? So look at this picture. Can you see this picture? Okay, I can see it. Okay, so here, this is the sound ah. Uh. Can you say ah? Uh. Ah. Uh. All right, very good. Can you say it again? Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Ah. Okay, very good. So now we will read these words. Okay, so can you read this word, Richard? After. Very good, after, how about this word? Ask. Oh, very good, how about this word? Answer. Yes, answer, how about this one? Ask. Okay. Arm. Yes, very good, arm. How about this word? Car. Mm-hmm. 
Fart. Okay, very good. Fart. <coughs> <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Fart. All right, fart. How about this word? Fart. Uh -huh. Can you say park? Park. Okay, very good. How about this word? Glass. All right, how about this? Father. Okay, very good. Car. Mm -hmm. Car. Okay, very good. Car. Mm -hmm. Bar. Bar. And? Star. Okay, so you use the pronunciation ah, okay? So when you see these, these letter, this is pronounced as ah, okay? Ah. All right, very good. So we have after, asked, answer, uh. asked, arm, car, card, fart, park, glass, Father, far, car, far, bar, and star. Can you say it one once more time? Can you say okay. it one more time? Okay. This one, can you read it again? After. Okay. Ask. Mm -hmm. Answer. Okay, number four. Ask. Okay. Um. Car. Card. Fort. Park. Glass. Father. Car. Car. Far. Bar. Star. Very good. <laughs> you are good in reading. Or you are good at reading these words. Good job, Richard. Now, let's practice reading the sentences. Okay? Can you read this one, Richard? Okay. How far is the car park? Very good. How about this one? We are starting in half an hour. All right. Can you say this word again? We are. All right. This is we are. Okay. This is the word we are. But you read this one as where. Where. Can you say where? Where. All right. We're where. starting in half an hour. This is our. Our. All right, very good. Can you read this one again? Okay. What we we uh, we start starting in half an hour. All right, very good. So this is where. Okay, we're starting in half an hour. We work starting in half. An hour. All right, very so, good. Yes, how about this word? Which part of the party made your lounge? Uh huh. <laughs> All right, can you read this one again? Lounge. All right, this is love. Can you say love? Love. Uh huh. Love. love. All love. right, this is in Vietnam, you call that. Love. Cười. Cười. Okay. okay. <laughs> that love. is love. All right. You are laughing. Love. Can you laugh, Richard? <laughs> All right. That is love. Okay. All right. So now let's move on or let's find out the meaning of manners okay manners. so now let's find out what is the meaning of manners can you read this one again okay meaning of manners 
All right, very good. So when we say manners, Richard, when we say manners, this is manners or manner. This is, can you read this one? Okay, manner. Or in Vietnam, you call oh. manner as? Is katuk. All right, katuk. Okay, so manner is the way that somebody behaves towards other people. Can you read this one? Okay. The way that somebody behaves towards other people. All right. So can you read this word? Behaves. All right. Can you say behaves? Behaves. All right. Very good. It is behaves. <clears throat> For example, when we say manner, Richard, how you behave in your house or how you behave towards other people. Okay, that is what we call manner. Okay, for example, you are a very good kid. You are saying thank you. Please, may I? So that is what we call manners. Okay, how you behave to other people. <coughs> Are you a behaved kid? Are you a good kid, Richard? Kid? Yes. Or student? Are you a good student? Oh. Okay. Yeah, I hope. No, 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 no. Yes, I am a good student. All right. <laughs> so, very good. Now, let's find out the vocabulary words or and familiar words, okay? So can okay. you say vocabulary? Okay. Mm -hmm. Can you say vocabulary? Vocabulary. All right. So when we say vocabulary, Richard, it means these are the words that you do not understand, okay? Okay. These are the words that is new to you or unfamiliar to you okay wait um can you can you translate it polite all polite. right polite all right i will translate that later but can you read this first polite all right very good polite how about this one mouth all right can you say mouth Mouth. Uh-huh. It's not mouth. It's mouth. mouth. Like, like teeth. Can you say teeth? Teeth. Uh-huh. <laughs> All right. Let's say it again. Mouth. 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 All right. How about this word? Food. Okay. Food. How about this word? Dinner table. Okay, very good. Dinner table. Okay, now we will find out what are the meanings of these words or what does it mean, okay? Oh. So we have here number one is polite. It's lich, mm -hmm, litsu. Yes, litsu. they know that word. Let's see. All yes. right, that is what we call polite. All right, can you read this one, Richard? Having or showing good manners and respect for the feelings of others. All right, so having or showing good manners, good manners and respect for the feelings of other people. Okay, so when we say polite, okay. we, mm -hmm. so when we say polite, it means you are saying good words to other people. Okay. Okay. So are, I am so sorry. My connect is sometimes sometimes is uh, no not good. 
Oh, your connection is not good. All right. How about you, Richard? Do you think you are a polite kid or a polite student? A polite student. Yes. Are you a polite I'm student? Really... For yes, example, I... yes. Are yes. you? Okay. Uh, for example, you are, what if you are going to the bathroom? What are you going to say? For example, all right. For example, you are in school and your teacher is teaching in front of your class and you need to go to the bathroom. What are you going to say? My example in the school is my teacher. Mm -hmm. All right, Richard, for example, you want or you need to go to the bathroom while your teacher is teaching in front. What are you going to say to your teacher? Mm -hmm. I am saying is... Uh, hi, teacher. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, or you can say, teacher, may I go to the bathroom? Okay, teacher, may I go to the bathroom? Yes, very good. So that, that is a polite mother. Big shark. <laughs> okay. So if you want to go to the bathroom, if you go to if you want to go to the bathroom while your teacher is talking or speaking in front of your class, you can say, Teacher, may I go to the bathroom? Okay. Okay. All right. Teacher, may I may I Go to the bathroom. Yes, very good. How about if yeah. someone give you a food? What are you going to say? If someone, what if someone gave you food? What are you going to say? Okay, my I, my idea, go to the, go to the, go to. Uh, go to the bathroom. Oh, bathroom, yes. <laughs> All right. So that is how are you going to say if your teacher is talking? So uh, we have another example. Okay, this one, yeah. Richard. What are you going to say? <sighs> if Someone gave you food. What are you going to say if someone gave you food? I will say thank you. Yes, very good. You should say thank you. Okay? Very okay. good. You should say thank you. What if... Uh, what if... You have a visitor in your house. What are you going to say? Huh? What if, what if you have a visitor in your house? What are you going to say? Okay, I will says welcome to my house very good <laughs> yes very good richard you should say welcome or you should greet them or say hello or good morning or good afternoon right yes okay so that is example of how to be a polite kids or how to be a polite person okay okay all right 
So now let's move on to the next one. We have food. When we say food, it is mun an. Things that, things that people or animals eat. Okay, so do you know what is a food? Do you know? Do you know what is a food? Uh, I am hungry. <laughs> you are hungry. That's why you want to eat food. Okay. Yes. Can you can you give me examples of food, Richard? Can you give me examples of food? Mm. Can you examples of food? Um, can you repeat uh, uh -huh. the things? Give examples of foods. Give examples of food. Uh -huh. Wait. Or what I... are what are the foods you know? Uh. What Let's are, are this one, Richard? What are the foods the foods you know? What are the foods you know? Okay, is taro meat, mm -hmm. um, cabbage, onions. Uh, egg and, and and yogurt. Oh, and yogurt. All right. So those are examples of foods. These are the things that we eat. Okay. For example, rice, meat, gum, chocolate. Those are examples of foods. Okay. Okay. All right. So now let's move on to the next one. We have dinner table or pan an. Can you read this one again? Dinner table. All right. Can you read the meaning of table? Dinner table. Yes. The table on which people are eating dinner. An occasion when people are eating together. All right. So, do you know what is a table? Uh, do you know what is a table? Um, wait. What does it mean? Uh, what does it mean of dinner table? Okay, so Richard, when we say dinner table, this is the place where you are eating. Okay, I I eat in the dinner table. Yes, this is the place in the kitchen where you eat dinner or breakfast. Oh, okay. okay. This is an example of dinner table. I will show you an example of dinner table. This one. Wow. Yes. It's beautiful. Uh huh. This and is what. Yes. This is where you eat, right? <laughs> this is an example of dinner table where you eat together with your family, right? Okay. All right. Oh, okay. Uh-huh. Do you have dinner table? Mm. Do you have uh, dinner table in your house? Uh, I have... Mm. Um, with you have do you have do you have dinner table in your house um i have 
Um, wait. Tình nước thì người ta gọi là cái gì? Bình nước này. Wait. Bình nước này. What is it, Richard? I have water bottle in the dinner table. Oh, very good. <laughs> good job. You use the sent or the word dinner table in a sentence. You have water bottle in the ta dinner table. Very good. <laughs> okay. So now let's move on to the next one. We have. Oh, your connection is. Mm. All right. Can you see my screen, Richard? Yes. All right. So we have the next one. We have mouth. Can you say mouth? Can you say mouth? Mm. Oh. Mouth. All right. Where is your mouth, Richard? Can you show me where is your mouth? Mm, where? It. Where? Where? Where it. is your mouth? Yes, very good. This is our mouth, right? <laughs> this is our mouth, okay? Can you show me your mouth? So mouth where where is your mouth is all right very good yes where we eat foods or the mouth is what we use when we are eating or talking okay okay all right very good so now richard let's move on to the next one Okay, I'll share my screen again. The next one is, we have this one. We have examples of good manners. Can you read that? Okay. Read everyone. No, 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 no. Example <laughs> of good manners. All right, number one. Read everyone who calls or comes home all right can you say comes home comes home okay for example you have a visitor or your friends go to your house you should greet them you should say hi good morning and welcome to our house okay okay mm -hmm. What if you saw your teacher? All right, Richard, example, what if you saw your teacher? What are you going to say? Okay, say please and may I? Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, Richard, this one. What if, what if you saw your teacher? in your school what are you going to say okay i will say hi oh, no 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 hello teacher um good mo oh, no, no no good morning teacher how are yeah. you Yes, very good. You will say, hello, teacher. How are you today? Or good morning, teacher. Or good afternoon, teacher. Right? Yes. Okay, very good, Richard. How about number two? Can you read number two? Say please and may I. All right, say please and may I. For example, you want to do something mm -hmm. for example you will go to the bathroom what are you going to say mm, okay 
Teacher, may I go to the bathroom? Very good. <laughs> yes, very good, Richard. How about please? When do we use please? Please. Okay. Teacher, please go to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> please go to the bathroom? Teacher, do you go to the bathroom, please? <laughs> All right. Okay. Now, Richard, you can say, for example, you are asking for something. Or you are asking your mom to buy you a shirt. What are you going to say? You can say, Mom, please buy me a new shirt. Mom, okay. please. Okay. All right. Mom, please. Buy me shirt. Buy me shirt. Okay. So if you want something, you should say, please. Okay. Please. Right. For example, please give me paper. Okay. Please give me paper. Okay. So you should always use please if you are saying something or if you want something. Okay. Okay. All right. Another example is mom. Please buy me food. Okay. Mom, please buy me food. All right. You should say please and may I. Okay. Okay. How about number three? Say thank you. Mm -hmm. Can you give me an example using the word thank you? Um... Um, I say thank you if, if, um, if mom, if mom, my mom is, so like is me, wait, okay. I translate. <laughs> you will say thank you if your mom buy you or if bought mom, you food? Yes. Yes, very good. And you will say thank you if someone give you something. For example, food. For example, um, money. For example, new clothes. You should always say thank you to them, okay? Okay. All right. How about number four? Never interrupt. Never interrupt. Okay. Do you know the interrupt. word interrupt? Interrupt. No. Interrupt. Okay. All right. So, Richard, for example, you have a visitor and your mom is talking to your visitor. You should not interrupt. Okay. Okay. All right. So, you should stay in your bedroom or behave okay? okay if someone is talking if someone is talking do not interrupt them okay, okay. all right how about number five everyone is born beautiful everyone is born beautiful and handsome mm. do you know the word beautiful Beautiful is um, rất đẹp, à, xinh đẹp. Okay. And handsome. Handsome, khéo tay. Ừ. Ồ. Handsome is? Đẹp. Is đẹp. All right. So, mm -hmm. everyone is born deep and beautiful. Okay. You should not tell to other students that they are not handsome or beautiful, okay? Okay. All right. How about number seven? 
Can you read number seven? Knock the door. Knock the door. All right. So, for example, you will go to the bathroom. You should knock the door before opening the door. Okay? Okay. All right. And for example, if you go to your mom's bedroom, you should knock the door before opening their door. Okay? No. You should knock. Do you know how to knock? Knock you know? the door. Yes, knock. <laughs> knock the door. Okay? All right. So now let's read again the vocabulary words. Okay? So number one we have... Can you read this word again, Richard? Mando. Okay, very Hard. good. Number, hmm? Food. Right. In the table. And mouth. Very good. Mouth. All right. So those are the new words that we've learned in this lesson. Now, we will move on to the story. Okay, can you say story? story? All right. So I, okay. want you, I want you to listen carefully, okay? Okay. Right. It is good to be polite. Okay. Keep polite. Richard, Keep let's, polite. Richard yeah. let's listen first to the audio, okay? Okay. All right. Wait a minute. Manners. It is good to be polite. People like you more when you are polite. Always say please and thank you. If you ask for some milk, you should say, please may I have a glass of milk. When someone gives you the milk, you should respond with thank you. All right. Okay. Can, can you read it, it? Yes. It is good to be polite. People like you more when you are polite. I will say please and thank you. If you ask for some milk, you should say, please, may I have a glass of milk? When someone gives you the milk, you should respond with thank you. Okay, did you understand the story? Okay, yes, <laughs> I understand. All right. For example, can you give can you make an example using the word please? Please. Please may I have a glass of milk? Or another example. Can you make another example? Uh, okay. Please may I have a soup or uh, no 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 bowl of soup. Okay, and yes, very good. Please, may I have a bowl of soup? And what are you going to say if they gave you the bowl of soup? Mm, what are you I, going to say? I will say thank you. Yes, very good. You will say thank you, okay? Or ex another example is please. May I have rice? Please, may I have rice? And then after that, you will say thank you, okay? All right, the next one is here. Oh. It is not difficult to be polite. You should not push or shove people. You should cover your mouth when you cough or sneeze. You should address people properly. If you are trying to get someone's attention, you would say, excuse me. You wouldn't say, hey, you. All right. Can you read it, Richard? 
Okay, it is not difficult to be polite. You saw not parts of several people. Mm -hmm. You so cover your mouth when you cold or sneezy. You so ad address people properly. Mm -hmm. If you are trying to get someone attention, you would say, excuse me, you wouldn't say, hey, you. All right. So can you read this word again, Richard? Can you say this word again? Sneezy. All right, can you say sneeze? Sneeze. Very good. How about this word? Couch. All right, can you say cough? Cough. Uh huh. Do you know how to cough? It half it half. All right. So in Vietnam, cough is what we called. Ha, yes. Ha. <laughs> and yes. sneeze is. Hát hơi. Sneeze. Okay. Oh. All right. Yes, I understand. Okay. So it is not difficult to be polite. Okay, you should not push or show people. Can you hear me, Richard? Oh, sometimes you can't hear me. Yes, sometimes. Yes, the connection yes. is sometimes not good. All right, so Richard, you should not push people, okay? You should not push or show people, just like here in this picture. What do you think this guy is doing? Mm -hmm. Can you translate is a e sentence? Richard, what I'm saying is, you should not push other people mm -hmm. you should not or you should not i'm sorry you should not push other people okay um you should not cause other people because it's not good all right for example you are playing with your friend you should not put or you should not push your friends, okay? Oh. And another one is you should cover your mouth when you cough and when you ho or sneeze, okay? So can you show me that one? How are you going to cover your mouth when you cough or sneeze? Mm -hmm. For example, you should cover your mouth, okay? <laughs> Richard, if you are in a public place or if there are other people and you want to cough or sneeze, you should cover your mouth, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh Can you God. do that also? <laughs> Can you do that also, Richard? <laughs> you should cover your mouth. Cover. All right, very good. If you want to cough or if you want to sneeze, you should cover your mouth, okay? Okay. Oh, <laughs> very good. <laughs> You should always cover your mouth, okay? okay? Now let's move on to the next one. And the next one is, can you read this one, Richard? If you are trying to get someone's attention, mm -hmm. you would say, excuse me, you wouldn't say, hey, you. All right. Can you read this one again, Richard? Attention. All right. Attention. Can you say yes? Very good. Can you say attention? 
A person. All right. For example, you want to call your teacher. For example, you want to say your or you want to call your teacher. You can say, "Excuse me, teacher." You would not say, "Hey, you, teacher." You should not say that. Okay. You should always say, "Excuse me." Okay. Okay, and you wouldn't say hi to you, okay? Yes, you should not say that, all right? If you want to call your mom, if you want to call your mom or your friends, if they are oh, talking to someone. If you want to call someone, <laughs> you call your friends. <laughs> you should not say, excuse me, mom. You should not say, hey, you, mom, okay? You should not say that, okay? <laughs> okay. All right, now let's move on to the next one. All right, so Richard, you are going to complete the sentences here, okay? You okay. should fill in the blanks. You should complete the sentences, all right? So let's read this one again. Can you read it again? Um, okay. Mm, mm. Can, you read it? Can you read it again? It is good to be polite. People like you more when you are polite. I always say please and thank you. If you ask for some milk, you should say. You should say. You should oh. say. Please, may I have a glass of milk? Okay. When someone gives you the milk, you shall respond with thank you. All right. Can you read this one again? Should. All right. Can you say should? Should. All right. Very good. Now you are going to complete these sentences. Okay, Richard? Okay. So, all right. So I want you to get your paper and write these sentences. You are going to complete the sentences, okay? Okay. Can you get your paper and pen? Yeah. Uh, can you get your paper and pen? Paper and pen. Paper. Paper. Pen. Pen. Paper, paper and paper. Paper. paper and pen. Oh, yeah, paper. <laughs> paper, okay? Okay. Paper. Yes, paper. And then you are going to complete the sentences, okay? Okay. To be. Do you know how to complete the sentences here? What, what, are, what are the missing words? Okay. Okay. To be. It is good to be polite. All right. I want you to write that one on your paper. Okay, very good. When you are, I love her, and you love me. I always say please and thank you. Very good. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> Are you then? Không thì thỉnh thoảng cô không hiểu những cái gì cô nói. Sometimes my Richard uh, can understand uh, what uh, what you say, so he feel. Uh, <laughs> uh -huh. it's okay richard you can ask me if you can understand what i am saying okay do not be shy to ask questions okay 
Okay. All right. How about the second one? If you blank some milk, you should say blank. May I have a glass of milk? So what is the missing word okay. here? If you have some milk, you shall say please. Please. Ah, uh -huh. can you write that on your paper? Mm, can you write? Can you, can write? you write it on your paper? Right, okay. okay. Please and thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, how about here? When someone gives you blank, you should respond with blank. What is the missing word? Can you complete that? Okay, it is good to be polite. Mm -hmm. You polite you more when you is polite. Is it R? Richard, is R. it is or R? It's oh. R, okay? It's R. R. Okay. It's How about this R. one? Mm -hmm. I polite. I always say please and thank you. Very good. How about it's the next one? You if you have some milk is it have is it have if, if you, you want. have okay very good if you want okay you saw the say you should say uh, please may i have a glass of milk all right very good Please, may I have a glass of milk? Good job, Richard. How about the last one? When do someone gives you milk? Gives you milk, yes, very good. You shall respond. Should. You should respond with thank you. All right, thank you. All right, very good. Thank you. Okay. Now let's find out if your answers are correct. Okay, we have here this one. It is good to be polite. People like you more when you are polite. Always say please and thank you. If you ask for some milk, you should say, please, may I have a glass of milk? And then when someone gives you the milk, you should respond, thank you. Okay? Okay. How about the next one? Can you read this one again, Richard? And then later, you are going to answer again, okay? okay. Can you read this one? It is not difficult to be polite. You should, uh -huh. you should, not, you should. Post, uh, you should not push a server pupil. Mm -hmm. You so you should cover your mouth when you coach or sneezy. All right. Can you say this one again, Richard? Coach. Couch. Uh -huh. Can you say cough? Cough. All right. How about this word? Sneeze. Okay. Very good. You should. You should address. You should address people properly. Okay. Very if good. you are trying to get someone's and attention, attention, you would say, "Excuse me." You would say, "Hi, hey, you." All right. Very good. Now let's complete the. You are going to answer it again, and you are going to complete the sentences. Okay. Okay. What is or what are the missing words? Mm -hmm. It is not blank to be polite. 
He shall not push off. How about here? Most. Uh, oh, beautiful thing. A self. Me, I saw the woman. It is not blank to be polite. You should not blank or blank people. You should cover your blank when you blank or blank. You should address people properly. If you are trying to blank, you would say blank. You wouldn't say blank. So what do you think are the missing words? Okay. Wait. I am so hot. It's so hot. <laughs> um, can you see the story? Okay. Do you want Do you want to read the story again? Yes. All right. Here. Can I, can I? It is not difficult to be polite. You should not push or shove people. You should cover your mouth when you cough or sneeze. You should address people properly. If you are trying to get someone's attention, you would say, excuse me. You wouldn't say, hey, you. Okay. Do you want to listen again? Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Um. Tell me if you're done, okay? Okay. If you are trying to... Oh, I want to ask you to say that I want to excuse me. Trying to... Uh-huh. <laughs> if you are trying to... To... All right, let's Question. listen again. Let's listen again to the audio, okay? It is not difficult to be polite. You should not push or shove people. You should cover your mouth when you cough or sneeze. You should address people properly. If you're trying to get someone's attention, you would say, excuse me. You wouldn't say, hey, you. Okay. Okay. Okay, I have finished. Oh, very good. So can you tell me what are the answers here? Okay. It is not this got to be polite. Very good. You shall not post a server pupil. You saw the cover your mouth when you coach and you cough uh -huh. and uh, or sneeze. All right. Or sneeze. 
is so address people properly. If we yeah. are trying to get what? Get someone's get attention. Some, to someone's attention. Mm -hmm. He would say, excuse me. You wouldn't say hi to you. All right, very good. Can you repeat this word again, Richard? Should. All right, should. can you say it three times? Should, should, should. Should, should, should. Very good. <laughs> You've done a great job, Richard. Now, let's. All right. So before we end our class, Richard. Can you tell me what did you learn from our lesson tonight, today? Can you tell me what did you learn from our lesson today? Okay, today I am learned for my uh, no, no, no. manners, nothing, and nothing, and nothing. Mm -hmm. And polite. Yes, and very good. Polite. Okay, very good. Today you've learned about manners. Examples we have polite, polite, food, 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 dinner table, food, dinner table, and Mouth and mouth. All right. So good job, Richard. <laughs> You've done a great job today. Okay. So we will continue our lesson next meeting. All right. Yes. Uh -huh. Do you have any question? Uh, no, I don't have a question to you. Okay. <laughs> so next meeting, we will continue our lesson. All right. And yes, please practice. Please practice reading the story again. Okay. Okay. I will send you the story and practice reading it again. And then next meeting, we will talk more about the story, okay? Okay, yes. And you should also practice reading more English books and listen to English songs, okay? Yes. All right. So you are very good today, Richard. You are very good in reading. Yes. <laughs> All right. So next meeting, we will practice making sentences, okay? Okay. All right. So that's it for today, Richard. I am very happy to teach you today because you are very smart. And you also listen to your teacher attentively. And you are very focused in our class. That's good job, okay? So I'll see you again next meeting, okay? Goodbye, Ivy, and goodbye, Richard. See you Thank again you so next meeting. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Goodbye. Hello. See you again. Yeah. Yes. Have you good holiday? What? Have you good holiday? Happy holiday. Yes, today is Sunday. Yeah, <laughs> today is Sunday. Happy Sunday and enjoy your weekend. Goodbye. Yes. <laughs> Thank you so much. Nice Thank you so much too. See you later. Yeah. See you later. Okay.